them. I just got the tickets. Uh, it was half price for me and this ad. And the tickets are 750 lira for one person. They even have Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam sword and, and Hazrat Ali Rizri Ratala on a horse sword. So. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! The Topkapi Palace was built in 1478. The beautiful palace covers an area of 700,000 square meters. This palace was used as the official residence of Ottoman Empire Sultans and was not only a home for Sultan but also administration, education and art center of the Ottoman Empire for four centuries. It was constructed adjacent to the famous Hagia Sophia. After the fall of Ottoman Empire, Topkapi Palace was transformed into a museum by the founder of Turkey, Kamal Ataturk, in 1924. Okay guys, so they gave us, gave us these phones each uh, that can tell us about the history of Topkapi. So I got my guide and I also have these tickets that, uh, that cost us 750 liters. The Topkapi dagger is an emerald studded curved dagger gifted to Nadir Shah, the ruler of Iran, by Sultan Ahmed. Nadir Shah was one of the most powerful rulers in Iranian history, but unfortunately he couldn't receive the dagger as he was assassinated the same night. This dagger is known to be the most desirable item of Topkapi Museum and it was featured in a Hollywood movie where the story was to steal it.
aunt that didn't know how precious this was to him. And he sold it for ordinary value. This beautiful spoon maker's diamond is the fourth largest diamond of its kind in the world. It is an 86 carat pear shaped diamond which was traded for only three wooden spoons. And what is that in your right hand, O Moses? He said, It is my staff, I lean upon it. And I bring down leaves for my sheep, and I have therein other uses. Allah said, Throw it down, O Moses. So he threw it down, and thereupon it was a snake moving swiftly. Allah said, Seize it and fear not. We will return it to its former condition. <laughs> 